I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to make a blimp. I take two fingers on the left and I put a dot, two fingers on the right, put another dot. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a big curve line up, over, and down to our dot. Come back to the left dot again. We're going to draw a big curve line down, up, and we're going to leave that opening right there because we're going to draw a curve line out, come back inside, curve line in, connect. Right above, we draw a slightly curved line up, down, connect, and jump over, slightly curved line down in connect. Come right about here on the left and we're just going to draw a slightly curved line down, slightly curved line over, slightly curved line up, connect. Inside we're going to add one, two, three, four straight lines, one, two, three, four straight lines, one, two, three, four straight lines. I come back over here on the left and I'm just going to draw a curved line up, over, connect, come down below, draw a curved line down, up, over, connect, and right here in the center we're just going to draw another curved line up, over, connect. Now, Come on the left hand side and draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line off the page. Come up here on the right, curve line, curve line, curve line, keep going, keep going, connect. And this is an overlap. We're going to start right here and draw a curve line out, curve line, curve line, curve line in, connect. Come up to the top and just draw a curve line out, up, curve line in, up, curve line in, up. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the two most famous airships, blimps, dirigibles, are the Goodyear blimp that we see at football games but also the Hindenburg, which was the very famous historical dirigible airship blimp that blew up because in the old days they used to fill these with hydrogen gas instead of helium gas and it turned out to be very, very combustible. So, because I want to do this as a picture of history, I'm going to color it gray like the Hindenburg would have been colored, but if you want to make it into the Goodyear blimp, you can color it a different color, a little bit livelier. But initially, almost the whole entire thing was made out of gray, and then the people were in here with the yellow. These are your windows. And this bottom part is really where people would be. The whole big part, this is part of the airship. Then, because I thought, I want to make sure you know it's up in the air, I added a very light loop-de-loop -loop blue all the way down and around. You will do a way better job than me coloring, but you get the general idea. I'm using blue-green. You could use regular blue, too. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my airship dirigible 
Zeppelin blimp all colored in, ready to take off for an adventure. Okay, bye-bye.